somewhere else where we don't sneak. We move over there, they move somewhere else. All that shit, man. We got these fucking eating my hoes out here trying to trying to get with niggas, man. They, Cause they go deep down inside that it's a rap for them, man. The best thing to do is get that, that Israelite seed in them, man. You know? Yeah, like the brother say, they uh, this country's going down and they can actually save it. Uh, but they not, you know, like with the financial uh, crisis and whatnot. Like they're doing QE2 and QE3, giving trillions of dollars to the banks. But if they took that same money and they gave it to the people and they make a condition that you have a bank account, you still be giving money to the banks, but you would give the money to the people. The people would spend the money in the economy and the economy will flourish and then everything will work properly. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying? You got, the, you got the thing with all lives matter and shit like that, right? And your ass ain't feeding the poor and shit. They got, they got little jackets out here and shit. That's all you can do, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't no ancient, we had a whole system, man. Uh, we, we invented the welfare system, man. We ain't talk shit about people or nothing, man. That's their condition. All you niggas talking about all lives matter. Ain't no, ain't no person, ain't no person being homeless or nothing, man. We got homeless shelters, but that shit ain't built for everybody, man. And they ain't like that everywhere else, you know? Oh, here in Omaha, it might be a little, a little upgrade, but you go down to the big city, you got niggas sleeping under bridges and shit, and they create anti, uh, anti, basically anti bum sleeping areas. As you look, you can see on the bridges, all the bridges ain't made to be slept, slept on, it's made to be sat on, man. It's, it's hard, it's, it's uncomfortable like a motherfucker to sleep on the bridges, man. Because they don't want nobody sleeping in the park, they don't want you finding a place that, to duck off and go sleep, man. But you didn't want to talk about all lives matter. It ain't all about black lives matter. All lives matter. But niggas out here, fucking bums out here sleeping on concrete, man. Same thing this brother's going over, man. Esau don't give a fuck about the masses of people, man. They care about themselves. All lives matter. That means them. Uh, damn, I forgot this. Uh, I, I don't know if it was a documentary or... Uh, but, but basically... Uh, it was like a drug. No, 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 no. It was a documentary. It was, it was narco dealing with uh, your boy. Basically, he started kidnapping people. Uh, um, kidnapping people, and and saying we was holding them hostage. And the people, basically, the government wouldn't move. They wouldn't bend into uh, yeah, Escobar. So he said, man, we are going after the wrong people. I need to go after the politicians' children, man. Damn. And when they did that, that's when shit started moving, man. That, that's what lives matter. That's how niggas are, man. Okay? Niggas don't give a fuck about death until it hits home, man. That's some selfish ass shit, man. Yeah, the ex-president, he actually said it in the movie or in the documentary. Because like the brother said, they was kidnapping, you know what I'm saying, random people. You know what I'm saying, they didn't want to do nothing. But once uh, the ex-president, once his daughter got kidnapped, he had gave uh, the current president some advice. He told him, hey, look, this before they took my daughter. And so he uh, he, he um, tried to hold something over his head, like a, almost like a blackmail situation. Like, you, hey, look, you got to do this, or I'm going to do this, or I'm going to do this. He's like, man, that's fucked up. But hey, shit, they got my daughter. I got to do what I got to do. Yeah. And that's how people are, man. So when they say all lives matter, they basically saying, stop, stop fucking <laughs> up our shit over here. Stop trying to be a revolutionary, man. Don't stir these crackers up, man. We all need to come together and make it to this. They already there, man. They've been to the city. I like to say on the, on the movie, the City of Lights. They've been to that City of Lights and back, and, and they travel fluently there. We're trying to fight and get to that spot. And that's basically an easy life, man. Okay? We're, we're, we're trying to get there. They go back and forth there, man. And then we, we we all need to make it there together. Well, why they ain't bringing us there, man? Why ain't they creating a path for us to get there, man? Why, why are our schools the shittiest schools you can go to? Why you why you set us up to have the worst job so we can't afford private schooling, man? Okay? All that other shit, man. You niggas going to college getting all these degrees, unless you suck that white man's dick, you ain't getting shit, man. You gotta have your head up his ass, man. 
you gotta come down, you gotta be a taskmaster for taskmaster for him, man. In order for, for you to come up, man. And now you ain't even a nigga no more. You just a you just a fucking soldier. Uh, uh, Esau, it, your, 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 your existence for success is, is not irrelevant now, man. You're just a pawn now, man. You know? The Uncle Ruffles. So, uh, I want to get into that, but we're we going to shut it down early because of, of the weather, man. Um, and the situation. But I want to get in there, Jew, and we're going to get into a pot, get through a little sit down. So, I got to uh, handle, some, handle some other business too, man. So, I got to nigga tied up. sanctified by the Most High the Father and preserved in Yahweh Shai Mashiach and called mercy unto you and peace and love be multiplied so I can be loved when I gave all diligence to write unto you of the common salvation it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints yeah cause we even though I didn't get, get to go over the Deuteronomy 28 chapter in, in full, that's all about if we don't contend. We need to contend. In order to contend, when you contend to the end, that's when you overcome, man. Okay, because Esau has all kind of weapons, from philosophy to actual weapons to ways of life, man, to culture. All lives matter shit. What do we, they don't give a fuck about us, man. Why the fuck they gotta be involved in some shit that they ain't even suffering from, man? I really don't give a fuck about the black lives, man, all lives, man, it, it, cause we know what it is, but it's just the, the, the fucking, the science behind that all lives matter, it's about everybody. Y'all quick to play, it ain't just about black, it's about everybody, we all, man, shut the fuck up, man. They don't got our problems, man. It's, it's quite clear. Why are you acting like they problems just as relevant as ours, man? It's not. But Esau trying to kick out the Muslims, don't want to let the Mexicans in. All that shit. Shut the fuck up, man. You know? And you niggas with that shit, man. That shit crazy, man. Go ahead. It says, for there are certain men crept in unawares who are before of old ordained to this condemnation, ungodly men turning the grace of our, our power, Yahweh, into lasciviousness. Now I want to bring this out because you got, if, we, if, if the masses get to this video, Nate and all these other niggas, they gonna, it's gonna rub them the wrong way and they're gonna be looking at us like, hey, these niggas go talking shit about the two thirds and this and that and, and, and the white man this and are, are you Egyptologist niggas? But this, this is y'all, man. Y'all are, are, are polluters of this truth, man. You Egyptologists, even y'all, man, because y'all have something to a certain level, man. You Jake, you know? Go ahead, read that again. John. It says, For there are certain men crept in unawares who were before of old ordained to this condemnation. Yeah, so it's really talking about like Nate, Yohanna, who of old ordained to this condemnation, man. They cut the hundred wets. Got the garments on. You worship than, than a damn Edomite with garments on, man. Cause you turned your back on your people, man. Like y'all say, y'all say we, we're suspect of having Edomites in our camps and shit. You fell off, man. You became an enemy of Israel, man. That's worse. You turned your back on your own fucking people, man. You talk shit, man. It says ungodly men. Turning the grace of our power, Yahweh, into lasciviousness. Yep, and, yep, un undisciplined lust, man. Okay, go ahead. And denying the only Lord power and our Lord Yahweh Shah Hamashiach. Yep, that's Nate. That's Nate down to a T. He's denying the power. Because all this we're going over today, he may bring out the heat. He basically gonna be like, oh yeah, y'all broke that down wrong. This is how you break it down. And, and, and basically try to make it, give it the American version of it, man. Okay, 10 years from now, uh, uh, and 10 years from now, it's Israelite groups, man. We need to uh, uh, build a factory to make, what the fuck are you talking about, a factory? 
You know, polite time out building the back and make weapons. How the fuck you gonna make weapons in the middle of your of your fucking in the fort of your enemy, man? This ain't no fucking this ain't Sparta, Spartacus, man. You think they gonna let your ass sitting underneath the Coliseum refine weapons to fucking take them over, man? You stupid? Your ass gonna walk around that fucking knife, that sword, in them clubs. They ain't gonna give you no armor. They ain't give you no horse. They ain't gonna give you all that important shit. They gonna let your ass have a have a full fire. You gotta get a gun permit, though. Okay? You gotta let your ass have a little assault right? You gotta get a gun permit. You ain't gonna bet uh, uh, annex, uh, become sovereign, and, and, and be in Utah sovereign, and, and, and uh, create your own weapon factory. And dish it out how you wanna dish. It don't work like that. Okay, this ain't this ain't Crimea, nigga. You know. Go ahead. It says, "I will therefore put you in remembrance, though ye once knew this, how that the Most High, having saved the people out of the land of Egypt, afterward destroyed them that believed not." That's it. Because all y'all niggas came from Egypt. All us Israelites came from Egypt. So the Most High will put you back in remembrance, because. Jake, that's how Jake is, man. That's, that's how you can tell how they is with dancers, man. Come on, new dancer, forget that old shit back in the day, man. Should be like four years ago, man. You saw, still got them old corny ass dance. They stink. That's all they got. Anything they pick up that's new is either from us or from another nation, man. You know, Esau still believe Elvis, Elvis is the king of rock, man. You know, Jake, this this whoever's hot, Tupac. Lil Wayne, Gucci Man, and Kevin Gates. They just move on to who's the greatest. Jay-Z. It just, it just moves along. They roll with the times, man. They ain't got no fucking lords. They, they act like they forget about shit, man. It's like this. We got these garments on out here. Oh, what are you guys doing? What the fuck you think we're doing? You know? Don't ask us no dumb shit like that, man. Sit and listen, man, because if you're in remembrance and, and, and you didn't give up your past, you'll know that we're doing what we, what a, this is a part of our culture, man. This is what the prophets do, did before the kingdom, before the fall of a kingdom, man. If, it, if the scriptures are part of you, go ahead. And the angels, which kept not their first estate, but left their own, habit, their own habitation, he had reserved in everlasting chains uh, under darkness. That's us. That's these bodies, man. Because that chain of darkness is when he put death in Adam, man. Saying you shall surely die. Okay? That's these chains of darkness. That's his flesh that that, that uh, causes us to sin, that influences us, us to sin, man. Entices us. Okay? Go ahead. He have reserved in everlasting chains under darkness until the judgment of the great day. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them, in like manner giving themselves over to fornication and going after strange flesh, are set forth as an example, suffering the vengeance of eternal fire. Yep. So the same way Sodom and Gomorrah gonna go out, the same way these bodies trapped in darkness gonna go out. Okay. If you ain't if you ain't in that light, which is the scriptures, you gonna you gonna basically eat the missiles, man. Okay. Likewise, also, these filthy dreamers defile the flesh, despise dominion, and speak evil of dignities. Yeah, so all you, you know, really, out here, we're dignitaries in Omaha, man. Because ain't nobody doing this out here, man. Hate to say it, it should, it should be people over us out here doing this, man. Okay, and we should be the, the, uh, the predecessors, man, or the successors. Okay, we supposed to have predecessors out here in Omaha, but we don't. Okay? When you guys pass this, niggas trying to do shit for the community. Talking about they want to go door to door and, and, and create a drive. Niggas had that shoot this weekend. I, 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 told, I told my people, I said, well, well what they going to do about that, man? Because that's obviously a problem in the community, man. Your ass ain't going to go over there, man. You going to fuck with them people, man. Basically, your ass ain't making no difference, man. You niggas still banging, banging each other up, man. Okay. 
Left is enough signs though. Yeah, call it, it a day. You need a you need an outlet, man. Jake needs an outlet. Jake needs culture, man. Our people needs a need a culture. Now all this all lives matter or we all need to come together. We need some shit of our own, man. And we're not gonna get that until the most high comes back. That's the only solution, man. If if we had a, um, a, 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 a Israelite community, so to speak, which that shit that Nate trying to do, I can understand, but Nate's being calm because the Most High said you can't go that route. You know, that's against the Most High's will because of these curses, man. All right, that that makes sense. You you build a a, a, a restaurant, clothing store, grocery store, um, everything you basically need in a, in one area. Okay, that will progress your your your, your people because all your money is circulating through your, your own people. Okay, but it, this society ain't gonna let that happen as as, as the uh, uh, the Black Wall Street showed you, man. You know, you still ain't gonna let that shit happen. So when when they, niggas came up to me trying to yeah, we need to build up, we need to go to community, we need to do this and do that, man. I ain't gonna do shit, man. Half these niggas ain't even on that level. Don't want to get on that level. They about getting money because of because niggas like y'all and influence them to be that be be materialistic, man. Go ahead. Says yet Michael the archangel, when contending with the devil, he disputed about the body of Moses. Durst not bring against him a railing accusation, but said the Lord rebuke. Yes, yeah, so at the end of the day. You don't gotta be all, we don't gotta be all extra. We just bring out the scriptures, man. And that's that's how we do it, man. You niggas are extra. You know, like, you talk all that shit about our, uh, our one of our apostles ought to recall about a biker jacket. When they deny the name, you ain't got shit to say, man. That's that extra shit, man. You should be on it. With Nate saying the name of the Most High is Christ, you're supposed to be like, oh, hell no, we about to tear him limb from limb. You know? Niggas don't show up for a whole winter. All kind of shit, man. You niggas just let that shit slide. You know why? Because you and you and your extra ass, hating ass, two third, Satan and bready ass nigga, man. Go ahead. But these speak evil of those things which they know not. But what they have known naturally, or what they know naturally as brute beasts, and those things they corrupt themselves. That and those things they corrupt themselves. They speak evil things that they know not, which is the kingdom of heaven, man. The name, the, the mysteries of the Bible, man. When you see fucking uh, 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 wheat that look like tears amongst the apostles, amongst the brothers, can you all mad and you speak evil of it, man? Because you don't, you don't know nothing about wheat and tears, man. I don't care if you read it and you break it down, you go into the definition, the etymology, it ain't on your spirit to receive that, man. It's like I'm arguing with a nigga saying, nigga said, yeah, man, I think Bruce Lee's a Jake. I said, and we got so deep into the argument, I said, well, we'll make you a, a Jake. Melanin? Yup. So I said, well, I think Conor McGregor's a Jake. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. See, that's what I'm talking about, y'all GMS people. Y'all, that's what, well, you said, well, if I don't agree with Bruce Lee's a Jake, does that mean you wicked? No. That's how niggas is, man. They speak all that knowledge. You can go all deep into the shit, but at the end of the day, you was, you was fucking shallow as a fucking baby class, nigga. You know? Hey, see if you can start you know what I'm saying? If you want to go carnal with it, Bruce Lee was darker than uh, Blake Griffin. And Blake Griffin's obviously a J. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Did that take him out? Yeah, but it, it's I'm talking about melanin, man. You got niggas that's, you know, darkest. Darkest day, man, and, and, and be Hamites and Edomites, man. You know that that melanin only holds so much, man. It only do so much. You know, it, it's basically the concept of a wildcat offense and a shotgun offense. Normally, a quarterback's back there, <laughs> but it could be a running back. Right. You know, does that mean that he's a quarterback because he's back there? No, that nigga's a running back. He may look like it and he sits in that position, it only holds so much weight, man. Being in that position on the basically having melanin only holds so much weight to, to determining your your genealogy. That's why the scriptures tell you, 
don't go into endless genealogy because it knows that you ain't gonna be able to find it at this point, man. It knows that you, why, why would you have a, a, a list of saying where you from? Because that means you look like other nations look like, look like us, man. That's to the point that you can't say, you can't look at a person, no, you ain't no Jake. You ain't no Jake. You ain't no Jake. Why you think they needed that, man? That, that, that type of census. Who's your dad's dad? Because everybody could, you know, we basically, our nation looked like every other nation, man. That's why we had that, man. Which shows you in the same time, we don't have no senses, so it's like, don't fuck with it, man. You just gotta go off the spirit now. It says, Woe unto them, for they have gone in the way of Cain, and ran greedily after the heir of Balaam. Yeah, now that's that's crazy because the way Cain Cain was jealous of his brother, man. Why? Because he he kept the law, statutes, the commandments of the Most High. You know. Yeah, the spirits give you utterance, man. Spirit, hey, that's how the spirits speak expressively, man. You niggas are, are are mad at the apostles, man. You're mad at the spirit of the Lord right now, man. The way the spirit of the Lord's moving. You seeing? You seeing? Us out here in the cold, that's that sacrifice. We're, we're, we're not sacrificing fucking carrots and lettuce and shit, man. We've got, we got rams, bullets, and turtle doves up here. And you come up here with apples and shit. And you mad, though, because you don't come out during the winter. You're mad because we speak the name of your how about Shin Yara Shai, man. Okay, you mad because we, we, we speak the truth on anybody regardless if it's man or woman, man. You're mad at that, you know? It says, uh, and ran greedily after the heir of Balaam for reward and purchased in the gainsaying of Cory. Yep, so you, that, you, go, you, you go to the enemy for the, for the, for the gain, for your, for your personal gain, man. I, every man got to work. My nigga told me, he a pastor. Niggas, the two niggas, you know what I'm talking about, brother. They say he a pastor, he got his Bible one c three. a man got to make a living. What the fuck you talking about? I ain't, I ain't got one. I make a living. The fuck are you talking about? ain't the only option in, 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 on planet Earth, man. That's an excuse. What are you talking about? You got to make a living. Now, you're not forced to do that, man. That's like me saying I got to go to college and say I got to make a living. And th that's not, no work. Okay? We're in slavery, so you're not going to come up, man. That bullshit ass excuse, man. You go and you tell people that, man. You got people, now you got our people doing this shit, man. That's why most sides say you, you, you have blood on your hands, man, because you destroy the innocent, man. Go ahead. It says, these are spots in your feast of charity, where they feast with you, feeding themselves without fear. Yeah, yeah, feeding themselves without fear because they gonna, they gonna tell you all this shit, they come up, and they ain't gonna help you with a damn thing, man. Them 